Page forty. How's the weather today? Listen and repeat. It's sunny. It's cloudy. It's raining. It's snowing. It's hot. It's warm. It's cool. It's cold. Page forty-one. The weather is terrible here. Listen. Hi, Jack. This is Jim. I'm calling from Miami. From Miami? What are you doing in Miami? I'm on vacation. How's the weather in Miami? Is it sunny? No, it isn't. It's raining. Is it hot? No, it isn't. It's cold. Are you having a good time? No, I'm not. I'm having a terrible time. The weather is terrible here. I'm sorry to hear that. Page forty. Page forty-one. The weather is terrible here. Listen. Hi, Jack. This is Jim. I'm calling from Miami. From Miami? What are you doing in Miami? I'm on vacation. How's the weather in Miami? Is it sunny? No, it isn't. It's raining. Is it hot? No, it isn't. It's cold. Are you having a good time? No, I'm not. I'm having a terrible time. The weather is terrible here. I'm sorry to hear that. Page forty-two. Dear mother, listen. Dear mother, I'm writing from our hotel at Sludge Beach. Ralph and I are on vacation with the children for a few days. We're happy to be here, but to tell the truth, we're having a few problems. The weather isn't very good. In fact, it's cold and cloudy. Right now, I'm looking out the window, and it's raining cats and dogs. The children aren't very happy. In fact, they're bored and they're having a terrible time. Right now, they're sitting on the bed, playing tic-tac-toe and watching TV. The restaurants here are expensive, and the food isn't very good. In fact, Ralph is at a clinic right now. He's having problems with his stomach. All the other hotels here are beautiful and new. Our hotel is ugly, and it's very, very old. In fact, right now a repair person is fixing the bathroom sink. So, mother, we're having a few problems here at Sludge Beach, but we're happy. We're happy to be on vacation. And we're happy to be together. See you soon. Love, Ethel. Page forty-three. Listening. What's the answer? Listen and choose the correct answer. One. Tell me about your apartment.
Two. Tell me about your new car. Three. Tell me about your new neighbors. Four. How's the weather? Five. Tell me about your hotel. Six. How's the food at the restaurant? Page 43. True or false? Listen to the conversation. Then answer true or false. You will hear the conversation twice. Hello? Hello. Is this Betty? Yes, it is. Hi, Betty. This is Louise. I'm calling from Mud Beach. From Mud Beach? Yes. I'm on vacation in Mud Beach for a few days. How's the weather in Mud Beach? It's terrible. It's cold and it's cloudy. Cold and cloudy? What a shame. How's the hotel? The hotel is terrible. It's old, it's noisy, and the rooms are very small. I'm sorry to hear that. Tell me about the restaurants. The restaurants in Mud Beach are expensive. And the food isn't very good. In fact, I'm having problems with my stomach. What a shame. So, Louise, what are you doing? I'm sitting in my room and I'm watching TV. I'm not having a very good time. I'm sorry to hear that. Hello? Yes, it is. Hi, Betty. This is Louise. I'm calling from Mud Beach. From Mud Beach? Yes. I'm on vacation in Mud Beach for a few days. How's the weather in Mud Beach? It's terrible. It's cold and it's cloudy. Cold and cloudy? What a shame. How's the hotel? The hotel is terrible. It's old. It's noisy, and the rooms are very small. I'm sorry to hear that. Tell me about the restaurants. The restaurants in Mud Beach are expensive, and the food isn't very good. In fact, I'm having problems with my stomach. What a shame. So, Louise, what are you doing? I'm sitting in my room, and I'm watching TV. I'm not having a very good time. I'm sorry to hear that. Page 44. Pronunciation. Yes-no questions with or. Listen. Then say it. Is Bob tall or short? Is Kate young or old? Are they noisy or quiet? Is it hot or cold? Say it. Then listen. Is the car new or old? Are you married or single? Is it sunny or cloudy? Are they large or small? End of chapter 5 Chapter 6 
Page 45. Vocabulary Preview. 1. Wife. 2. Husband. Parents. 3. Mother. 4. Father. Children. 5. Daughter. 6. Son. 7. Sister. 8. Brother. Grandparents. 9. Grandmother. 10. Grandfather. Grandchildren. 11. Granddaughter. 12. Grandson. 13. Aunt. 14. Uncle. 15. Niece. 16. Nephew. 17. Cousin. 46. My favorite photographs. Listen to the model. Who is he? He's my father. What's his name? His name is Paul. Where is he? He's in Paris. What's he doing? He's standing in front of the Eiffel Tower. Do exercises 1 through 14. You will hear the correct line after you speak. 1. We'll begin. Who is she? She's my mother. Where is she? She's in the park. What's she doing? She's riding her bicycle. Two. We'll begin. Who are they? They're my parents. Where are they? They're in the dining room. What are they doing? They're having dinner. 3. We'll begin. Who is he? He's my son. Where is he? He's at the beach. What's he doing? He's swimming. 4. We'll begin. Who is she? She's my daughter. Where is she? She's in front of our house. What's she doing? She's washing her car. Five. We'll begin. Who is she? She's my wife. Where is she? She's in the yard. What's she doing? She's planting flowers. 6. 
We'll begin. Who is he? He's my husband. Where is he? He's in our living room. What's he doing? He's sleeping on the sofa. Seven. We'll begin. Who are they? They're my sister and brother. Where are they? They're in the kitchen. What are they doing? They're baking a cake. Eight. We'll begin. Who are they? They're my grandmother and grandfather. Where are they? They're at my wedding. What are they doing? They're crying. Nine. We'll begin. Who are they? They're my aunt and uncle. Where are they? They're in Washington D.C. What are they doing? They're standing in front of the White House. Ten. We'll begin. Who is he? He's my cousin. Where is he? He's in front of his apartment building. What's he doing? He's skateboarding. Eleven. You begin. Who is she? She's my niece. Where is she? She's at school. What's she doing? She's acting in a play. Twelve. You begin. Who is he? He's my nephew. Where is he? He's in his bedroom. What's he doing? He's sitting on his bed and playing the guitar. Thirteen. You begin. Who is he? He's my friend. Where is he? He's in his apartment. What's he doing? He's playing a game on his computer. Fourteen. You begin. Who are they? They're my friends. Where are they? They're at my birthday party. What are they doing? They're singing and dancing. Page forty-nine. Arthur is very angry. Listen. It's late at night. Arthur is sitting on his bed, and he's looking at his clock. His neighbors are making a lot of noise, and Arthur is very angry. The people in apartment two are dancing. The man in apartment three is vacuuming his rug. The woman in apartment four is playing the drums. The teenagers in apartment five are listening to loud music. The dog in apartment six is barking, 
and the people in apartment 7 are having a big argument. It's very late, and Arthur is tired and angry. What a terrible night! Page 50 Tom's Wedding Day Listen Today is a very special day. It's my wedding day, and all my family and friends are here. Everybody is having a wonderful time. My wife, Jane, is standing in front of the fireplace. She's wearing a beautiful white wedding gown. Uncle Harry is taking her photograph, and Aunt Emma is crying. She's very sentimental. The band is playing my favorite popular music. My mother is dancing with Jane's father, and Jane's mother is dancing with my father. My sister and Jane's brother are standing in the yard and eating wedding cake. Our grandparents are sitting in the corner and talking about the good old days. Everybody is having a good time. People are singing, dancing, and laughing, and our families are getting to know each other. It's a very special day. Page 51. How to say it. Introducing people. Listen. I'd like to introduce my brother. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. Page 51 Listening Quiet or noisy? Listen to the sentence. Are the people quiet or noisy? 1. He's listening to loud music. Two. She's reading. Three. He's sleeping. Four. The band is playing. Five. Everybody is singing and dancing. Six. He's studying. Page 51. What do you hear? Listen to the sound. What do you hear? Choose the correct answer. One. For he's a jolly good fellow, for he's a jolly good fellow, for he's a jolly good fellow, which nobody can deny. Two. <laughs> Three. Four. <laughs>
five. Page fifty-two. Stressed and unstressed. Page fifty-two. Pronunciation. Stressed and unstressed words. Listen, then say it. He's playing the guitar. She's acting in a play. She's riding her bicycle. He's sleeping on the sofa. Say it. Then listen. We're baking a cake. They're sitting in the yard. He's washing his car. She's sitting on her bed. End of chapter six.